Looks like this is our lucky day. Uh, maybe. Yeah, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yeah, well, the less I see, the happier I am. I feel you. Those things are a major pain. Made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp, considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. Um, no, actually. There's only so much we can do here. We should go. Motels run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. Well, that's true. As long as we get something, I suppose. Shit. Oh, oh. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. Well, crap. Yeah, we're not going to be able to claim that, Lee. No way in hell are we getting up that. Yep. See? Told you. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. We better get a move on. Yeah, yeah. I gotcha. Uh, let's see. Jeep. You won't be able to push that, Lee. You're silly. You're really silly. Hmm. hmm. Indeed. You're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Oh, I see. Hmm. Uh, I don't think that's going to be helpful. Hmm. hmm. Oh. You're very insightful today, Lee. Why is there nothing I can do here? There's no safe way through that mess. It doesn't look like it. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. They sure are. Oh. What's this? Hmm. Looks like it still works. Okay. Well, let's do that then. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Uh, you kinda killed her dad, man. Like... You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. No, you... You didn't, actually. You really didn't. Like, there was a chance. Like, a really strong chance, but... You didn't have to. You didn't know any better than the rest of us what was going to happen. You got scared, and I can understand that, but... There's no reason to kill a man. Your girl still upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week? Uh, I kind of wouldn't blame her. It's your dick. What do you think? Christ, I've heard your opinion. What's done is done. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. Um, yeah, that would have been terrifying for a kid. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? 
Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. God damn it, Kenny. Get it together, man. Jesus. Jesus. You okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. Now get ah! off here. No! No! Uh oh. No no! No! Oh no. Help me! Lee? Somebody uh, help me! Oh god! Oh, Let's start god. moving. What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus. I don't think so. It's a it's a human, friends. The people like you. Help her. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. You move your fucking legs, that's how you get to her. Fuck's sake. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her. Jesus, Kenny! Think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Kenny! No! I'm not gonna be a monster. You help people that need help. You're still human, Kenny. Or at least I hope so. Now look what you do. Let's move. Oh, you're not hurting too much now, are you, dickhead? Sure, run. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! It's sturdy as hell, but we ain't got much time. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. Yes, sir. Right, we got a medical box. Go. Pills, more pills, some of these things, some of, some of those things, energy bar, gimme, uh, this way, grab it, open it, quickly, <laughs> quickly, god damn it, open it, open it, there we go, move along, move along, come on, grab all the things, you'll need that bandage, oh shh, no, let me take the bandage, Damn it. Up and over. Okay. Still clear. Let's hustle. Oh, oh no. Oh no. No no no. You're not killing off Lee. Kenny, you better fucking help me, mate. Kenny. Kenny! Really? You motherfucker. Uh, Once more with feeling. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh no. No, no, no. Come on. We're on our own lead. You gotta do it yourself. You can't trust Kenny anymore. Get out of here. They're everywhere. You took care of yourself, didn't you? Not that I had much choice. Oh, I don't like this. Hey Ben. You got promoted to lookout, did you? That's good. Hey Clem. You're back. <laughs> ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. <laughs> <laughs> the 
That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Catch you soon, Clem. Hey, Lily. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Ha. Huh. Kenny, please. So, what did you get? Um, we actually got quite a lot, I think. Well, by my standards, that's a lot. A lot of stuff. We got bandages fine, and an energy bar. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. Because piling into an RV with you after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not uh. graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. And that's all beside the fact that Macon is busting at the seams with Walker. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the right. group, though. And Both I of you need to shut the fuck up. One. Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. Lily's concerns are valid, you know. Of course you think they are. God damn it, I'm not on anyone's side. Kenny, this is about everyone. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. What about medicine? What about medicine? We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? Some Excuse girl me? Was screaming out of an alley, she had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. Fuck he you! Had... He put her out of her misery. Stupid. I couldn't let her suffer. We're all suffering. Some more than others. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! Oh. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Oh no. Now everybody get out. Well, that's not good. <sighs> Are you happy, you dick? Happy, Kenny. My family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great stress. All I know is whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a Because thing you are. For once. For once. You are a bad guy. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. I think it's too and late I'd for like that. I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Of course. Starting to think you're the only one that can trust in this camp. Except Clementine. I, I trust Clementine more than you. Sorry. Uh, right. Let's go talk to Lily. Hey Lily, how's it going? I'm sorry. 
You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? Um, neither, to be honest. I just, yeah. I think you're coming unhinged. I know. I'm trying. I'm trying. I just I feel like a crazy person. Can I do anything for you? Yes. I need help. There's we a know. traitor. Somebody. Here. One of us out there. He or she or they have been what? taking things. You, you do need help, but not this kind of help. You, you need to see someone that... Um... You haven't really been sleeping. Don't start in on that. You've been through a trauma, and you're not taking care of yourself. It counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I oh. see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. Oh. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Uh, I guess I'll do it for you. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the greatest detective, <laughs> and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. <laughs> That's Robin. I know who it is. Well, for God's sake. Uh, sure, why not? You can help. Don't tell anybody. Secrecy. <laughs> Good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. Oh, God damn it, Doc. All right, sure. Good luck, little buddy. Huh. Okay, so... I'm going to talk to you first. Hey, Clem. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Eh, uh, what you doing? What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. Oh. See, it's the same. Um, kind of. Ah, oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Thanks. Uh, do you like do you it? like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. Yeah, kind of. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Oh, <laughs> what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you oh. do that? Yes. <laughs> to you later, Clem. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> hey, Carly. Talk to Lily yet? Yeah. She thinks supplies have been walking away. Really? There's some broken equipment, too. I'll look into it. Thanks for doing that. Yeah, no worries. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Who doesn't? I think about you, too. Our group is small. You're kind small. of. What? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, 
But think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Oh. I don't think that's a good idea. It was a lifetime ago. Which is only going to make the feeling that you hid it and that there was even more to hide that much worse. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I... Uh, I don't want to lie to you. Hmm. I also don't want to let people know, but... Oh, what to do? Fuck it. I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. Okay. Oh. Don't call me small. Well, you had to go on your tiptoes. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Uh. Yeah, sure. Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. I don't know what a Malbec is. S uh, sorry, Carly. Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And <laughs> the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. <laughs> Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> you uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Yeah, I get that feeling. She's kind of coming loose in the head a little bit. It's a little concerning, to be honest. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. Yeah, that's true. I'll see you in a bit, Carly. You stop putting bugs on people's pillows. God damn. Hey guys. Hey you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Yeah, I'm doing good. Uh, I'll come back to you in a second. I want to talk to Kenny first. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? Bills. I gotta pay. It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? Come on. Oh. No, I don't want to tell you. I don't Forget trust you. It. Never mind. Have it your way. Why do I even try to talk to you? I don't care what you have to say. Uh, ask them about the flashlight. Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Okay. Ace machine. Got it. Is that over here? Yeah. Okay. There's some broken glass on the ground there. There sure is. Hmm. Yep, that's your boy. Oh. Hello. There's something drawn there. It's uh, a cross, sir. Hmm. Chalk. Pink. Hmm. 
Doc. A clue. <laughs> what do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. Mm -hmm. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. <laughs> Bye, Doc. <laughs> I don't know. It's not her. Was someone marking this place? Who would do that? That's inside the fence, so. It would have to be someone from in here. Hmm. Hey, Clem. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. <laughs> Lee. Hey, Doc. What's up? I found something. What is it? What? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. By really? the gate? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues Yeah, and... Doc, I got it. Good job. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I can't leave you hanging. There you go. Cool. You done good, kid. More chalk. Hmm. Okay. Mm. Somebody was over here too. See, I did oh. good, huh? Yeah. Yeah, Doc, you done good, kid. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Okay, let's go. What the hell's going on here? Those bandits gave us hell, but they've been quiet for days now. Oh. Bandit problems, huh? I want to see where this X is on this side of the fence. Nope. Not getting to. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Hello. There's a grate down there. Sure is. There's stuff in it. Take it. Oh, hello.